Hello, this is Cast Blue, and welcome to the Mars Lighthouse in Let's Play Golden Sun, The Lost Age. Last time, we came to Prox, and, well, we've basically determined that they're not really that terrible, but they did sort of lose our parents. And also, we're climbing the lighthouse now, because there's no one left. Okay, I can't do that yet. Uh, I bet I need to turn this thing on, like I did with the Jupiter. We didn't need to do that with uh, Mercury or Venus in the last game, but we were not the first piercing to climb either of those lighthouses. It was the Felix's crew that beat us to it, so... They presumably turned the lighthouses on before we got there. Um... Pound! We got... It's a Mimic. I wasn't 100% sure on whether this would be a Mimic. The possibility existed in the back of my mind, but it, it struck me as low risk. I did, after all, have to use the Synergy to reach it. And I'm not even bother- if that- okay, good. I'm not even bothering to use Synergy on this, because it's dead. And- oh, I got a cookie, that's actually pretty nice. Okay, gonna use this on Isaac again. Synergy is a little bit lower than I would re really find ideal. Uh, well, I'll look back here, but I probably want to go up. Actually, I can totally break this. I think. Uh, Blast, which is... one of you has it. There it is. Blast first, same difference. No, that didn't work, okay. Well, in that case, I guess I need to go up more. As I initially- oh, there's actually a thing here. Let's go this way instead of up. Oh, it's a different way up. This is probably the more correct way up. Minos Warrior. Yeah, that's still pretty good. That's also actually pretty good. <laughs> oh, that unleashed was just sort of amazing. It's the simple things that are often the best. And that definitely qualifies. Pound! I gotta say, it does seem a little bit silly to me that you never get a synergy that just sets something on fire. Like... It seems like a real oversight. I mean, if you get syner you get synergy to grow things, you get synergy to freeze things. You can spontaneously freeze and create water, but you can't spontaneously create fire. It just seems a little bit odd. Uh, can oh, okay. I mean, I was gonna do this anyway. First, That did not work. A shaft of ice is poking through the floor. Okay, so... So, what do I do? Pound? No, I didn't really think so. Mm. Somehow I doubt it's frost. I'm not gonna be a hover not going to be Cyclone. I mean, I can do this, but it's not going to do anything. Also, I see you there, Ginny. I see you. Don't think I won't come for you. Hmm. Maybe Force. No. I have no idea what to do here. Uh... Yeah, I have no idea what to do here. How do I break the ice? Oh. If only I knew the answer to that question. Uh, you know, I want to be on the bottom, so I'm going to just retreat. I'm going to try to take that other staircase now, and hopefully it leads to something I can actually interact with. Uh, although more probably, I just need to use like the magma ball or something. Oh, okay, you went before me. That is kind of not great. I should be the one who goes faster than you, not the other way around. 
But, you know... Oh, no. I can almost kill you both in a single round. Not quite. I am only mostly good. Let's see... Incidentally, I just want to point out that those enemies were worth a thousand XP. The double phoenix combo was still worth over 7,000. It's kind of crazy, and if I'm remembering right, and I might not be, I'll admit, but if I'm remembering right, that's still not even the best one. Yeah, I'll bet that this is how I get that Ginny, actually. And I want the Ginny. Ginnies are good. Oh. If you do not hold the star, you shall not ascend to the heavens. Be gone! Okay, so I need the Mars Star to progress. Dragons burning with might, they rule the fires. Fish, with cold courage, they rule the water. Bird, on the wings of truth, they rule the winds. So, I bet... Hmm. Hmm. Man. With the power of wisdom, ruled the earth. That's very interesting. But obviously I can't go this way because I don't have the damn star. Which means I do need to go the other way. Which means I need to figure out how the hell I'm supposed to do that. Hmm. I mean, I'm pro- I must be missing something obvious. I know I- This room, I know the solution to, but I can't do it yet, because there are those pedestals around the room, those will eventually have fire on them. And then I can use my fire control thing to basically blast the room with flames. But, they are not yet lit. So I can't actually do that yet. Hmm. For that matter, I'm not actually sure how to light them. Hmm. Well, no, I'm pretty sure I light that one by blowing fire to it from this one. I'm pretty sure that's the case. Then if I do that, this will spit out fire and unfreeze all this shit. However, again, it needs to be actually lit. So... So... The thing here, open up a menu, that means it wants me to use an item here. I don't know what item, or well, an item or synergy. I have tried several synergies before, not all of them. So... I'm going to either try a few probable cause items, or else cycle through all of my synergy. Which I'd rather not do, if we're being honest. I would really prefer to not do that. So, there's a shaft of ice poking up through the floor, I know. So how do I unfreeze it? Pro oh! Grind might work! It worked! And there's a big crack in it now! Okay, so it was a synergy I didn't yet use, but I figured it out without having to... without having to resort to random... to trial and error. Which you know, That is so awesome. I think I'm getting so much damage from that though because I'm getting a critical hit. I think it's possible to get a critical hit and an illusion at the same time, although it might not be. I'm not totally confident in that uh, in that claim man so much money so nothing to do with it <laughs> like the only the only thing i could really do with my money at this point would be to buy and sell artifacts so as to grind up more game tickets which you can totally do it's not hard <laughs> And as, as previously established, I have stupid amounts of money and really very little to do with it. I mean, I guess I'll end up spending a little bit more on the blacksmith, probably, but... But I'm not, I don't have much left to spend my money on. I haven't for quite a while, though, in fairness. 
The money is probably a lot more important than the first Golden Sun because you regularly get equipment from shops that is actually better than the artifacts. But in this game, you almost after we pretty much after we got a boat, we never had any equipment, or at least we never got any new equipment that was better than our artifact equipment. Actually, no, that's not true. After the Maria, that's true, but that's a much shorter time frame. Because I definitely bought equipment on some of the islands that I got went to after getting the bow. Hmm. Well, anyway. I know what you do, but we can't do you. But right now, you do nothing is what you do. Sort of like that bird I just murdered. Hammer Sphere. It's a giant crushing ball, but I didn't kill the bird. It may resist Earth. Because I'm pretty sure that crushing ball is Earth aligned. I just can't see it being. I just cannot see it being anything else. Okay, uh. I mean. I probably don't want to get burnt, but. Oh. Well then. That. Not going this way. Oh no, I'm totally going this way. I just... I just did a whoopsie. And this is a little bit annoying to push, but if I want to get to the other side... Actually, before I do this, I'm going to look into other rooms, because that will be rather time-consuming. So, I'm definitely going to go that way, but not until I've exhausted my other uh, options. Because it strikes me as unlikely for that to be where the Ginny is. It's, or uh, even treasure. It's rather, I think it's rather more likely that that is the way to progress. Okay, that's where this room is. Yeah, those fires will totally push me down. So, is there anything up here, then, is the question. I mean, there's a box there I can't reach. from here, anyway. Anything else? Uh, no, and no. Okay, I guess we're going into the flame room. Man, I should actually feel like I should speed this up, because it's gonna take a few minutes to actually get the stupid statue to the other, other end of the room. It is... This is... Honestly, this is... I mean, it's not even really a puzzle, it's mostly just having good sense of when you move this so you don't get burnt, but... It's definitely one of the... We'll call it a puzzle anyway, and it's definitely one of the slower puzzles in the game. Okay, wait for you to be over there. Hide behind the statue... I guess I could just use move on it, but... I mean... Sh uh, that was close. Oh yeah, that hurt, but I'm okay. Uh, it did deal a small amount of damage, but it seemed pretty inconsequential. Now this one is more important to not screw up on. It's a smaller area, it moves faster, uh, no. And there's a significantly less security about, you know, being pushed off the edge. I don't think... Yeah, I should be safe from that. You know, I should have just done this the first time because there's totally a pad on the ground there. I could have moved this once and it would have stayed here. Oh, well. Can't take back the past. Okay, this is an ice puzzle. Uh, I don't believe I can- no, I totally can. And we're on the other side! What is over here? Oh, hey! I can show off the dragon thing! You can do that, and like that. I mean, even with a regular attack, I think you're one-shot- or you're guaranteed to one-shot these, let alone of that sort of insanity. It is a little bit inconsistent, though. 
It is dealing like that massive damage on a lot of enemies, but there's some where it's not really that massive. I'm not really sure what's up with that. Blaze! Wait, what happens if I do it again? Oh, okay, it just stays the same. Okay then. Well, whatever. I guess it just means I need to break from the other side. Yeah, like right here, actually. With with the power of burst! Be gone! Although, I have to wonder what's in this door as well. I haven't found the requisite mimic yet, for one thing. Uh, and that feels more like the way to progress to me. It, since it required going on both sides of it. Whereas this is sort of off to the side on its own, it seems fairly self-contained. It's more likely for this to be a treasure of some kind. Just use the power of blades! And the way forward shall appear. Although, were this lighthouse not completely frozen over, one would wonder about the practical use of such a device. Ooh, it's a box! Now, considering where I am, I don't think that this is a mimic. But if I miscalculated and this is the way to progress, then this is probably a mimic. No, it's over Calcone. Nice. Definitely gonna have one more visit with the the guy, um, the blacksmith. Okay, yeah, that's uh, that's scary. What's on the other end of this? That's what I want to know. That might hurt me, and it would definitely knock me back. So, well, there's a thing here. Okay, this is starting to feel more like the way to progress now. So, I'm gonna go back and check out that other room. Do that, 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 and that. Still really cool. Although, you know, I should have attacked that bird... I should have assigned my orders differently because I think Shiva has a slightly higher attack power than Jenna right now. Uh, yeah, she does. And feel whatever feelings hits is a given that's going to die, so it would be better to assign Shiva and Isaac to attack the same target in those situations. Doesn't matter for you assholes though, because you are not very strong. Although, you're still strong enough to survive a hit from Jenna, apparently. I mean, it's not really fair to beat up on Jenna about that, since I'm the one who... G it's totally my fault for having given... Oh. Okay, well that's nice, but I can't actually do anything with you. So this is, in fact, the way to progress. I'm surprised that box wasn't a mimic then. Okie dokie, so this one is pretty simple. We need to smash all of the things. Like so. And then and then we'll be able to safely run to the other end. I think I can I could probably get away with just smashing them on one side. Uh and there's no boxes on the on the end of there, so you know we're gonna try to run on with on just the left side. Uh you know what, I don't think this is, on second thought, I'm less, no, no, that, that totally worked out. I, for a second there, I wasn't so confident. Kill the Minos. You need to get that Ginny though. Uh, hmm. Oh, it's a Ginny! It's not a, it's the same Ginny, but it's totally a Ginny. And, you know, I can totally get you right now. So, we're gonna do that. I'm gonna save now, because I have no idea when the hell I'm gonna run into it. Okay, so... Nope, that's wrong. 
Wait, no, it's it's right but wrong. How can it be both? Because I screwed up. Uh, I need to, um... Uh... There. We need to do this. And now... It is... No, I've gone the wrong way. I want to do more something like... Not like that, either. Like this. Man, I just did this. You'd think I'd remember, but nope. And then I'm like this, and... Ha! The genie shall be mine! Oh, you are freaking kidding me. You know what? I bet I can just re-enter the room. Like, I don't need to do anything special for that. I can just do this. And fight it again. So I don't even need to reload. That actually takes less time. Now, Death Leap! And... Uh, I mean, this is a water genie, so... I guess you Shine Plasma. You're gonna use Eruption, though. And, I mean, Plume Edge isn't really great. Hmm. Well, whatever. As long as it doesn't run away, it's fine. I guess I could have used some Ginny to actually try to paralyze it. Um, haven't really done that much, have I? Uh, but you know, I'll bet you that this will just kill it. Oh yeah, that'll kill it. Well, maybe not. No, no it did. It was water. I mean, Red Dragon's apparently water-based, good to know. Uh, but... We got Balm, which does... Revives all down to- okay, I actually explicitly want this one on the back row, so... I'm gonna do that just for testing purposes. You can do- wait, what? Oh. Well then. I mean, I'd rather class up you than have an appro- you know what, this is actually better anyway, because this is a genie I'm gonna want to use if ever I'm in battle. So, okay, uh, I don't know if Shine is actually any good, but my choice of, well, Strike Through Defense is good, so yeah, Core is good, uh, Torch is good, let's, um, well first, let's do this, War Adept, I'm losing synergy if I do this. Uh, I'm gaining a lot though. What am I losing? Wind Slash and Shine Plasma for Thundermine? Is Thundermine actually any good though? What if I do- you're still a Fire Monk that way. Okay, I'm gonna need to do research on this. Uh, actually, looking at the time, I think I'm gonna end the episode he here. Join me next time when we find out the exciting conclusion to what Ginny Jenna is equipped with. Until then, this has been Let's Play Fun- <laughs> Final Fantasy? I haven't done Final Fantasy in how long now? Come on, dude. This has been Let's Play Golden Sun, and have a good day. Bye!